Hi everyone! So I've been awake for a long time already. I was working early this morning and then I actually had to get a driver to go meet up with my boyfriend and then from there he took the driver to the airport. So by the time you guys see this, I think he'll be back. I had to do that. I feel like I'm wearing the same thing from yesterday but I have on my slacks from Sashik. I think that's what the brand is called. And then the shirt is from Brandy Melville. It's from Jay Gout, that brand in Brandy. I do have to go to Koreatown to run a few errands today. So I have like a lot on my plate right now and I'm like... I'm like not as stressed out as I feel like I would be. I should go get my brain scan just to see how stressed I am. <laughs> but um, I also want to go to a chiropractor because I want to get my back aligned. I've been doing this like once a month for the past, for like this year. And it's really been helping me with my back problems because I do have scoliosis. I want to do that. And then I have a session with my therapist like later today. I think in the evening I requested for like 5 p.m. And I also want to go to H Mart, so I know I just got groceries, but I feel like I need like tofu and like other stuff, like just little things, ramen. <laughs> I'll bring you guys along with me. I don't know how long I'm going to be in Wilshire Center. I want to like be cautious, you know? I was told like I didn't have to wear a mask, which I was like, what? Like, I guess if you don't have the virus, like you don't have to wear a mask because it's not really going to help you much. I'm going to go run my errands. I think I'm just going to get a driver straight there because I don't really want to take the train. But I reloaded my card the other day, so I might just take the train. I don't know. We are back in our grocery haul stance. Um, I think they're the cups. These are the cups here. I'm gonna sterilize them. Oh, these are bigger. Wow, this is a lot bigger. It's by a little bit. They're like a tiny bit bigger. This was like the perfect size, but it's fine. I'm gonna sterilize these. I also got a mount for my iPad because I've been needing one. So I just got this one. It's like a silver one. I don't know. I like that it's, it feels pretty sturdy. So I'll use it when I'm doing my makeup and stuff. Let me show you guys what I got from H Mart. We're gonna do a grocery haul. There's a little bakery close to H Mart. So I just got a ham and cheese croissant from there. I got my seaweed. I love putting these for like rice balls. I just got regular seaweed just in case I wanted it. I also got Sam Yang chicken noodles because I love these. They're really good. I got some uh, sesame seed leaves for what I'm gonna make for lunch. And then I also got this uh, American Wagyu brisket thinly sliced. This one I'm so excited about. I'm excited to cook that. I'm gonna make it for lunch. And then I also got this one. This is the short rib. I got this brown sugar boba ice cream. I just wanted to try it. Everyone was like talking about it. I got these kimchi dumplings. I also got this corn dog, um, breaded mozzarella and fish cake on a stick. And then I got two Spam and the spam light and then i got a mayo thing of mayo this is my last bag i got gin ramen again i got the spicy one kimbap kimbap uh i got this one this is just like a regular the regular one so i'm gonna try that got a firm medium firm tofu for the soybean paste soup that i'll make later and then the rest is just strawberry milk i got like six of these and they're two dollars each which is kind of expensive but I wanted it, so I got it. Okay, so let's go ahead and make lunch right now. I think I'm going to do like ASMR style or I might talk to you guys. I don't know. I don't want to grill it. I, I want to just make it on the stove. But how can I use that? I'm going to put everything away and then I'll be back. And then we'll go ahead and cook some lunch afterwards. So this is what her cabinet is looking like now. I left some unpackaged snacks, like her treats. We had to stock up because of, you know, fear of the virus. Um, if we're quarantined, you can't go out and, you know, get stuff. So um, we just got Luna's treats. And then these are all the open ones that I want to get rid of. Um, well, not get rid of, but just give to her. And then I want to see if she likes, if she still likes this deli cat. If not, we'll donate it. And then this one is the one that she already has open, but I just refill this bag because they don't sell it by the little bags. I mean, I think they do, but this is just like better, better value. So I just take the product from here and I put it in the little bag so it's more manageable. She tried this one, but she didn't eat it at all. I just got the small bag just in case she wouldn't like it. She used to, but I don't know why she doesn't like it anymore. I sometimes mix the cat chow, this one, the Purina, and she likes that one as well. I think I'm going to cook the Wagyu first. 
I'm gonna add one spoon of sugar. I'm gonna add two spoons of soy sauce. A teaspoon of sesame seed oil. I'm gonna add just a little bit of the chopped garlic. I'm also gonna put in like, oops, a spoonful of the gochujar, which is a pepper flakes or two. I'm gonna put like one and a half spoon of the gochujang and then just mix it. Again. Pretty fast. Just putting a few pieces in here. So I just finished my lunch and I have kimbap here. I have the pearlies and I'm gonna put the wagyu in there and then eat it with some rice. This looks amazing. I'm so excited to eat. Hi guys, I filmed one video today and I don't even know if I'm going to be able to edit and get it up for tomorrow but I have a pretty long filming day tomorrow so I wanted to get that done and then I obviously also have work that I have to do on my computer. Yes, I have the heater on right now because it just got so cold out of nowhere. I think it's like probably 50 degrees or something outside. I know some people are going to be like, that's so warm but <laughs> for us it's very cold. You see Luna right there. I've been so lazy to clean this up but let's... Let's do this really quick. I actually have to do my makeup tomorrow morning, so I think let's just put everything into into the makeup bag. I'm like half cleaning up. I like to put everything together where they belong. I really love this makeup bag. I think it's been very good for me, and I feel like it's just probably one of the best one of the best purchases I've ever made. Because I do travel with it sometimes. Sometimes I don't. Like if I'm in situations where. I feel like it's a bit too bouge, then I won't bring it, but I don't use this top portion for anything and the color, I don't know if you can see the difference of the color of the vaqueta, but pretty light. I still am going to keep this on top of here. I was thinking of getting the piping replaced, but not anytime soon because it's not bothering me too much. It's still very pretty. This bag does like sag a bit. I think I'll do a review, a review on it probably tomorrow if I have time, but I definitely want to give an update, especially if it's something that I use every single day. So I'll go ahead and do that tomorrow. There's my sad iPhone 10. <laughs> So I'm going to try this out today. It comes with four of them. To be honest, I don't really like boba. I don't even know if this is the right one. I hope it is. But I'm going to try this out. I might throw it away after like a few bites, but we'll see. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. How is the boba still soft? Mmm. Mmm. Very sweet. That's so weird. I, I want to check the calories. That's not bad at all. It's only 154 calories for one bar. That's really crazy. I don't really like it. It's like okay. Like it's not like best. Good morning you guys. It is Friday and I like don't know what to eat right now. I feel like I have so much food and I don't know what to eat. But I'm gonna have some water. I know a lot of people always tell you to like skip breakfast because it like helps you lose weight. Like lose because you don't have to have like the extra calories. My face looks so bloated.
I'm pretty much just gonna put everything together because I feel like they take the same amount of time to cook. Hey guys, so I was filming today, but I don't think I like the footage. I'm just not happy with like the color of the footage just because the Sony a5100 it like it softens your skin and that looks nice and everything but the color is just not vibing with me right now and I want it to be more like true to color like how this is so I think I'm going to refilm that tomorrow morning and just like pump out videos in the morning because right now I just like don't have the energy for it I really like want to and I love filming for you guys but I haven't filmed a sit down video in over like three weeks so it's been a long time for me I'll gather my thoughts tonight and get everything prepped for tomorrow I just made some tea I used my little heart tea strainer thing it's so cute you guys I have to play with her in a little bit I think probably at six so I'm gonna play with her at six o'clock and then hey 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 you can't do that Oh, she's so cute. I got these from Amazon. This is the Skin Iceland Hydro Cool Firming Eye Gels. And I got these because, I don't know why, but for some reason, every time I get my lashes done, the lash, um, the gels that my lash tech uses is actually really, I don't know, I think it's irritating to my under eyes because I always get a, like, dermatitis under there right after. So I wanted to try these because they're, they're a little bit more expensive. So I want to see if using something that's more expensive might work better for me. And then if they don't, then I might just take a break from lashes for a while just because they've been irritating my eyes. This is what I'm gonna have for dinner. It's like fish cake with, with mozzarella and I'm gonna put sugar on top of it. They come in like individual packages. This looks so good. I'm so excited to eat right now. I hope you guys are having a good dinner. <laughs> I just finished filming my second video of the day and now I'm gonna get something to eat because I haven't had breakfast and I think it's already like noon or I think it's one o'clock, let me check. 12.50, so I'm gonna make something to eat. I think I wanna cook the Wagyu because I don't want it to go bad. I also have salmon that I'm probably gonna have for dinner. Yeah, Luna really wants to play right now, but I'm starving. I have to actually cook the rice before I do anything, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that first. Can't wait for the bananas to ripe so I can cook them. We're gonna let that sit for a bit, I think for like 20 minutes, and then I'll come back to it and start cooking. I don't know if I showed you guys the flowers bloomed, but this is what they look like. Um, wow, they drank so much water because it was like up to here, I think. But this one is completely open. It's so pretty. And then this one, this one, this one's still kind of closed. I don't know what is wrong with it. And then this one is completely open. They're all opening really nicely. It's so beautiful. I love them so much. They're like pretty basic flowers, like this would probably cost $10 in um, downtown LA, like the flower district, but this one is, I think is the prettiest one. I love the, I love the shape of it. Roses are just so beautiful, especially when they're in colors like these. I love them so much. Also, I wanted to tell you guys that the freaking corn dog last night, amazing. I want to go back and get another packet because they were so good. I think it was like $7.99 or $6.99. For a packet but it's just so worth it like one i think like three corn dogs at young ring is like ten dollars so that was very worth it i'm just wearing my hrh tank i love this tank top so much it is pretty thin but she made the straps a little bit thicker but i like the original i'm just drinking some water because i haven't had water today i just had some tea okay also let me know your guys' favorite shows on netflix because i am just i have nothing to watch anymore i already watched the gabriel hernandez case i watched um blacklist ncis i watched um what else i don't like those shows where like they have the automatic like laughing like i hate those i hate those kinds of shows but um let me know what you guys are watching so far so i can watch it too because i would really like to watch some new shows and i feel like i have enough time on my hands where i'm able to like watch at least like an episode a day or two i want to watch something new so let me know what you guys are watching i'm just like into youtube videos right now um just because i don't know what else to watch i need to get rid of like this fat like <laughs> but i'm gonna make something to eat and i'm also i'm gonna make like the wagyu but i also want to make some more of the corn dog so i'll show you guys what i end up doing oh this is my hair um 
with the smaller curls i feel like i used to curl my hair like this in high school it's pretty and i like that i don't have to curl it every day because it kind of keeps its curls especially if you put hairspray on it like just put like a little bit you know spritz it the curls like they start to look more natural the more that you wear them so i just like would curl the top and make it look a little bit curly and then have the rest just be however it is just so it can give you like a more natural-esque kind of look The corn dog's pretty, it's like a good size, I would say. And it's 270 calories, which is not too bad. So I'm gonna just cook it in there. Um, it was pretty like stringy, the cheese, but I would add it in a little bit more if you want it more stringy, but I thought it was perfect. Like I like the, the um, temperature for it, so. I'm just gonna put the meat in here. So this is my lunch for today. I'm so excited and hungry. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat. pretty much finished cleaning up and everything i'm just gonna head to the office so i think i'm going to hop in the shower just because i'm so tired right now and i don't like want to be tired so i'm gonna drink a cup of coffee right after i get out of the shower and i want to just like wash my hair and everything and just like feel refreshed because i've had my hair like this for a while and then i also want to use my eye patches and put on like a face mask because my face feels a little bit dry um so i'm just gonna wash off this makeup in the shower but yeah i thought i had my lashes on for two weeks already but it's only been a week which i'm like what because i feel like my lashes have like fallen off a little bit faster this week so I might have to go get them filled at the two week mark. I don't want to get them filled so soon I always wanted like I always want to wait for like two weeks or no three weeks Sorry, but I feel like this time I might have to go a little bit earlier But it's also good so we can try out the eye patches I'm just gonna wait and see how they hold up and hopefully hopefully they do because like we just got them done But um, my eyes are also very sensitive. So if like a lash is bothering me. I'll just like pick it out <laughs> So it's also like my bad, but yeah, okay. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna hop in the shower and do like some self-care routine or something like that And I'm gonna bring my iPad into the bathroom because I'm gonna use it after I get out So uh, you guys think this is stupid like I'm having to update you on everything I'm doing I think it's fun. Like I love seeing people's lives, but Sometimes I feel like my life is so lackluster. But anyway, let's go so I just got ready for bed. I'm going to just watch Dateline and go to sleep. Tomorrow I'm going to go to my friend Judy's house and we're just going to hang out and probably go eat or just get something and bring it to her house. That's pretty much it. Um, I wanted her to make the old, but I think she was going to make me katang one day, but I didn't end up going that week. So maybe we can make it tomorrow or we can just go get, go get it from Hot Hang. But I don't know. I can't wait to have my food. I'm so excited. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi everyone, so today's Sunday. I'm getting ready to head out to go to my friend Judy's house. You guys have seen her in a vlog if you guys have been watching me for a while. So I'm wearing this meshki top. I'm wearing these pants from Sashik because they're like trousers and I really like trousers right now. And then my Superga because I have the white here so I just wanted to put it somewhere. And then I'm just wearing my Givenchy bag. I also didn't tell you guys that this bag seriously like fell. Um, let me go talk about that right now because I have not told you guys about that, but I need to make sure everything's off. I wanted to talk to you guys about the Givenchy bag because it, like, like I said, it literally fell. I was going to the Beverly Center, I believe it was. Yeah, the Beverly Center to express for like a campaign thing. This was like in February. And while I was getting out of the car, out of the Uber, my bag was just like fell on the ground and I was so scared. It happened in the car. Like I, I sat down and I noticed that the buckle was like undone on the bag. So then, I put it back together and I was sitting down, whatever, it was time to leave. When I got out of the car, it was actually in a like a right turn lane, so I wanted to hurry up and you know not be an inconvenience to anyone, even though that wasn't a drop-off spot. So I got out of the car and my bag just like tumbled on the ground and then the strap like came one of the straps went flying up and I was just like, Oh great, this is just 
this is just great so that's what happened and i didn't get any scuffs on it which i was really surprised because it is the smooth leather i would assume that it would be more susceptible to scratches so um i got really lucky on that part and i was just like terrified honestly i was so scared yeah i'm happy that i don't have any other scratches on it because i feel like after the scratch happened when i was like in the grocery store with the lady i was just really scared just because it never really came off like it's kind of it's still like a smudge there like i don't know if you can see that so it's not like completely perfect like i would want it so i'm gonna Givenchy tried buffing it out but they told me to just use like leather conditioner and stuff and i was like why would you tell me to do that if like i'm at your store like shouldn't you be doing it like helping me yeah i guess because they couldn't find the bag in the records and i told them that it was from Saks, they kind of felt some type of way so i don't know i was like kind of upset about that but i don't know what we're gonna eat or what we're gonna do i know we always get boba judy and i always get boba i'm just waiting for this driver it says eight minutes because he's completing a ride oh three minutes oh what the heck that was fast okay i need to put some lotion on my ashy arms and then we're gonna head out bye <laughs> So I just got home and I just realized that I'm missing a screw from my camera like what so I'm gonna email Canon and see if they can send me a replacement because like what I'm so confused I don't know if it's like I don't know if it's in my bag or what but like when that could have happened I didn't what the fuck anyway I'll show you guys what I got from H Mart I should look online for that um, okay so we went to H Mart and I ended up getting some more um groceries i really didn't mean to i don't know why i just keep buying groceries i spent like 250 dollars on groceries this week alone and i don't know why i keep buying more when i have not finished the first batch that i purchased so anyway i got this one is tupoki and this one is from koreatown k-town and i guess it's like a popular one that a lot of people eat so i saw it in a few videos so i wanted to try it why do we look so okay and then I also got some pork, some frozen pork. You can use this for shabu shabu or just grill it. So I'm gonna grill it. I also got these chips that I saw in a, in a Korean video. And then I got some chopsticks because oops, I got some chopsticks because I needed more. I know that my pack with Daiso came with three pairs, but for some reason I can only find two. And I know I wasn't going crazy. Like I know I had three pairs. I don't know where the third one is. I have no idea because I only see two. I think what happened was that the housekeeper probably like accidentally threw it away. But anyway, I got more. And then I got two um, mangoes. I forget what these are called. They're, they have like a name. Uh, I got two mangoes. And then I got um, kimbap because this one was like the fresh, the fresher one. And then I got some the other day, but I think it's not, like not good anymore because it's been sitting there for a while. And then I also got three pairs of the spoon and then the metal chopsticks because sometimes i just prefer the metal ones in my second bag so h mart in long beach actually has the what's going on with my lashes i need to go get a fill h mart in long beach has the carbo noodles so i got the coconut um cookies i got two of the onion rings i don't even know where i have no space you guys like no space for anything i got the carbo noodles and I got white vinegar because I needed it for the sauce that I'm like cooking and I might cook that tomorrow when my boyfriend gets home and then I also got this little pack of like shrimp chips I thought this was so cute so you can just take it with me and then from Daiso we went to Daiso also oh this I got this from a pantry like the not pantry from the pastry shop it's called Tu Le Jus 
to le jus. I don't know, but it's a red bean paste. I also got these two little um, like bread loaves container because I want to put the banana bread in here because I think it'll be like really cute and like really cool to like put the tiny ones. Also portion controls. And then I got this one to put on my hair because sometimes when I'm like filming videos, my hair is just always in my face. So I got that. This is my HRH pouch. And then I also got a whisk. I needed a smaller one because the bigger one is just too big. And I like using this for baking and then also for cleaning my rice. So I got that. And then the last thing I got from Daiso were just these gloves. They're kind of big, but I like I like them because when I'm doing like the rice wraps or if I'm cutting garlic, I don't want the smell on my hands. So I just got a little pack of this. That's everything. I got so much stuff and I probably shouldn't have. But anyway, how are you guys doing? Um, I had such a fun day today and why I really need a lash film. I'm really upset about like the freaking thing. This phone is so slow, it's so annoying. I bet you it's gonna be one of the first things that come up. I'm just gonna buy like a little kit. I figured it out, I'll email them first and then hopefully. Anyway, those are all the things that I got. I'm gonna put this in the freezer. Yeah.